You know the internet, right? There's a website for almost everything. It has changed the way you communicate. And for anything you could think of, there's a way to search for it. All of a sudden, you have the world in your pocket. And you want to extend that magic into everything that surrounds you. Because you know that when you do, amazing things will happen. That's the internet of things. And with the Wi-Fi, it's as easy as it sounds. Hi, I'm Daniel. Hi, I'm Tim. And we're in the Netherlands, modeling the Python in the first Wi-Fi standard. And we have been busy for the last year building something really amazing, the Wi-Fi. The concept of the Internet of Things is quite cool, but making it happen requires a strong knowledge and electronics and experience with wireless stuff. That's for the hardware side of the story. When it comes to the software, then you need complex development tools, some serious C and C++ ninja skills, and a lot of time spent writing and debugging tons of lines of code. The Wi-Fi takes the wireless freedom of Wi-Fi and combines it with the power, flexibility, and ease of use of Python. We designed the Wi-Fi from the ground up with one goal in mind. Let's make IoT developing fun. The core of the software running in the Wi-Fi is MicroPython, a lean and mean implementation of Python 3, specifically optimized in terms of speed and memory to be able to run efficiently on a microcontroller. The hardware is also top-notch, combining a Cortex-M4 with a state-of-the-art Wi-Fi network processor. The Wi-Fi is all about openness and freedom. The whole software has been open source in the beginning, and it will always be. And when this campaign gets funded, we will make the hardware open source as well. Forget about needing cloud servers to download your software to it or special tools to compile your code before you can run it on the hardware. The Wi-Fi executes your Python scripts in real time. There are no strings attached, really. The only limit is your imagination. What you do with the Wi-Fi, it's completely up to you. Developing with the Wi-Fi, it's a piece of cake. You just need a breadboard, the Wi-Fi itself, and a power source. That's it, you're online. From that point on, you can connect to the Wi-Fi Stellnet server and start hacking right away using the Python interactive shell. Once your code is ready to go live, you log into the FTP server and upload it. The Wi-Fi has it all, but with great power comes great responsibility, so we have built a beautiful and intuitive Python API that exposes every feature of the hardware. Seriously?